Mr. Chairman. Senator Portman. I'd like to offer a Portman Amendment number one as modified. You may proceed. Uh, the goal with this bill all along has been to provide CISA with visibility into these cyber attacks on our private sector uh, companies and, uh, and also with regard to FISMA, with regard to the government. In order to do so, the bill provides companies protection against liability for the act of submitting those reports to CISA. And that liability protection is very important to the private sector. As noted earlier, that the private sector is represented by groups like the Chamber of Congress, uh, the Chamber of Commerce uh, support this legislation. Uh, one reason they support this legislation is that they believe that we um, are going to handle the liability issue in a balanced way. In other words, we're, we're not trying to create new lawsuits and we're not trying to stop lawsuits that would be appropriate. We're just trying to keep it as it is. And so in order to do that um, and to keep that balance between plaintiff and defendant in civil litigation, um, I'm proposing a provision that would ensure that plaintiffs are not given an unfair advantage in litigation by being able to obtain these reports that we're requiring in, a, in the discovery process, or the documents or other materials that are actually used to create the report. Uh, I know this has been a, a, a controversial issue, um, and I want to thank Chairman Peters for working with us to try to get to something that, again, achieves what uh, what the business community expects and what I think we expect as a committee, which is to end up, again, not creating new advantages or disadvantages, but holding on to the status quo. Uh, I would also ask that this amendment be modified, uh, as it has been in the writing you have, uh, if you have it before you, to exempt religious organizations from the ransomware provisions. They're, of course, already exempted from the broader one, the critical infrastructure one. But um, uh, Senator Scott raised this today. Others have raised it. And I do think that's appropriate to exempt them from the, um, the ransomware provisions. So that would be uh, the modification to this Portman Amendment 1. Thank you, Mr. Chairman. Thank you, Senator Portman. And, uh, and I appreciate uh, our work together on this to, to have neutrality, uh, which I think we achieved uh, in having uh, support from all folks uh, engaged uh, in this. If there's no further debate on this uh, amendment, the question is on the adoption. All those uh, in favor say aye. 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 All those opposed, nay. Opinion of the chair, the uh, ayes have it, and the amendment uh, is agreed to.